Yo guys, welcome back to another video. And on the channel today, we will be starting A Road to Glory with Aston Villa. This series will all be about career mode on FIFA 20, waiting for FIFA 21. So, first things first, what we're going to do is we're going to check our starting lineup. As we do have Grealish, he's going to be one of our main players in this series. I think we need to. Uh, improve on the centre mid and the defence El Ghazi Young Grealish obviously Young Samatha average age and all that so we need to be careful of ages in this series as well because don't want to let people be going down in ratings so what have we got here so we've got 57 million to spend at the start of the season so the transfer market is open the um, objectives that we're going to have to try and complete so we've got to try and get to the round of 16 stage in the Emirates FA Cup uh, we've got it to do within at least two seasons have at least one player from Youth Academy start uh, sign one crucial player first team players assigned to four positions finish mid table and finish with a profit margin of 27 million so what we're going to do first is we're going to possibly get a new midfielder so Douglas Rees good player but not the highest ratings and we just need a better overall player so episodes will be around 50 minutes each and uh, they will be posted daily and we're going to see how far we can get in this road to glory career mode by Christmas so we're going to have a look is there any decent ones we could sign young Billy Gilmore he's very young Gundogan Henderson's old so probably not going to go for him Jones got great potential, a bit overrated in real life. Cater, Loftus Cheek, Neves, very young player. So we're going to shortlist Neves. I think he could be a very good improvement. Alex Oxlade Chamberlain. And that's around it, really, in the Premier League for the centre midfielders. So, we'll be signing at least two players in this episode. That's two players in the episode. Probably we'll play around maybe one or two games as well, depending on how long these episodes are going to be. As I said, probably around 15 minutes. So the introductions took really long. Right, so... Gonna simulate all the way to the start of the season, guys. Also, training is gonna be a big thing in this series. We'll also be wanting to send people out on loans and like this, as an offers came in from Florente or Florentina, how you say it, for Henry Lansby. He could be a good player, really, just a bit old. Player chat. Jack Grealish, one of our main players on this series. Captain, what a leader, what a player. Now we're going to advance into further into the season. And again, is it an offer for 13 million? But we're not going to be selling him again, as he's going to be one of our main players for the series, as well as Grealish. Good player. What we're going to do on the 20th, probably another one, a year loan, so we can let him go out. 
Also, this series will be played on legendary game mode, by the way, guys. So, so first things first. As you would imagine, we will be getting Jack Grealish in that train and drill as we want to let him to fill his full potential. So we're going to have two for Jack Grealish. Put him on a medium. One for McGinn. So I said he's going to be another main player for the start and season. Trezeguet probably not as much Horahan could be a reserve for him Tyron Mings is another good player and we're gonna do another one for Tyron Mings so they we're just gonna simulate the first training session and it's A's and C's across the board it's a good start So we're going to go all the way to the start of the season now and play our first game of the season. Potentially though, we're going to sign after we've trained these guys. I think I've made my decision and we're going to be signing Ruben Neves. So 26 million wants to be offered between 33 and 46. So we're going to approach the loan and maybe, maybe not so. We're going to go straight in for a buy offer. See if we can get it for a 30 million offer. Yeah, I also customised my manager before this, so. So we're going to give him a straight 30 million offer and see what he says. 41 million, so moves that. And we're going to go down to... 37 37 million 43 million try and get an offer for 40 million maybe yeah we've got a deal there 40 million for Ruben Neves I'm going to go straight into the negotiations for this player very young and got loads of potential Crucial, yes. Five years, will he accept? Yes, he will. Disregard release scores, so he wants 47,000. We're going to remove that bonus and see if he will. 57,000, that's a fair offer. Ruben Neves is in the Aston Villa team. Chamberlain, it was a not the hardest decisions as Chamberlain's a little bit older than so Douglas Ruiz and 82 Ruben Neves is straight in that team so we're gonna bench Courtney Howells I'm pretty sure his name is so So they want Neil Taylor. We can let him go for 1.3 million pounds. Right, we're going into our first game now. First game of the season. Can we get off to a win? Have to see. Taylor saw a loan offer for Jed Steer. That could do him well. 86 rated. Solid player. Another notification. Horahan, no, not at the moment. Because he might be out of one. If McGinn does get injured. More players being loaned out. It's good to see. Loan offer for McGinn. We're not gonna do that. And now we have the Premier League background of the FIFA 20. I'm aware that FIFA 21 is out, and we will be doing one of them later on on the channel. Tottenham first game away of the season. Thank you for 
quality to low position. I think the squad is definitely capable of going in any trouble. Could take a while for him to settle in, but I'm not. I don't think it will. So, first game is away against Spurs. Going in our green kit, Grealish is the captain. So Mata lead in the front. Pepe Reina also in there, one of our other highest rated players. 80 rated, pretty solid. Decent keeper as well. Right, let's start this game. Could have a really good start here. So here we are at Tottenham Hotspur Stadium. Going to be a tough game here at the first game of the season, but we could come out with a win. So some matters going to pressure. Grealish, obviously, we need to try and get him on the ball the most. Good header away. McGinn. Samata gives the ball away. This is going to be a very hard first game. It's the likes of Son, Kane, Deli Ali, all very good players. Here's our new signing, Neves, on the ball. Great ball out to Grealish. Here's Jack Grealish. Plays into Neves. Neves could get a ball back to Grealish. It's a good run, it's unlucky. First attack, Neves getting involved. Target's going to have to get out there. Does. Very good. Here's Grealish could start an attack off here. Plays it back. That's good. Neves with a great ball. As we see, El Ghazi's made a run here. El Ghazi's got the beating of him. Ball pass. Maybe should have played Ruben Neves there. Gilbert doesn't win it. That went out. Referee doesn't see that though. Tottenham fans in very loud voices here. First game of the season, obviously everyone's excited. Oh, and Son sent me there. Gilbert's gonna have to get back. Fake shots around him. Back to Son. Son fake shots again. Keeps it on the line. Brilliant from Son. Kane plays back to Soko. Soko could have a shot. Great block. McGinn pressures Ali. So Soko gives away. And here comes McGinn. Out to El Ghazi. On oh, Samata with a brilliant first torch. Samata could be away here against Vatongan. Puts back inside. Sees the run of N N Nakamba and he puts Aston Villa in the lead. Aston Villa takes the lead against Tottenham Hotspur. It's brilliant. It's a brilliant attack from Aston Villa and Nakamba puts Villa in the lead against Tottenham Hotspur. Oh, straight to Nakamba again. Nakamba couldn't really do anything there with it though. Our aim is obviously to try and aim for the, at least the Europa, maybe the Champions League spot. Might see Grealish push into that cam spot throughout the season as well, as we know he's very strong there. Great tackle from Gilbert, doesn't get done by Son this time. Here's come Villa on the counter attack again. Played over through Neves. Here's Neves. Driving with it. Straight to Grealish. Danger player, back into the centre. Poor pass though from Grealish. It's unlucky from Villa though. one and here comes Neves could drive them away Grealish here's Grealish plays Nakamba and Nakamba gets away from Davidson Sanchez it's not a bad ball in Grealish was held there couldn't get there in time 
wasn't enough to for a penalty though. It's promising as Aston Villa are for getting their foot in this game now. It's McGinn to Neves. Neves into Grealish. Grealish can turn. Grealish does turn. Turns into the Tottenham Hotspur player though. So Matt have been very, very strong in this starting starting opening game of the season for Aston Villa. Poor pass comes off him though. And Mings has been drawn out. Here's Harry Kane. Mings recovers. Brilliant defender from Mings. And that is the first half over. Aston Villa do take the lead at the half time of the first game of the season. Has been a bit scrappy in this first game of the season. Will we see one shot on target as well? One shot, one shot on target. Just very clinical. We're going to see a change of formation here. It's going to be a 4 2 3 1 narrow. McGinn and uh, Nakamba sitting in. Grealish at that cam. Neves is going to change for Nakamba actually, and we're going to see Nakamba come off for Trezeguet be very strong this could be and we'll see how it goes on Grealish could be more effective here now so we know he likes to play in this position of course the Aston Villa trying to go for a lot of possession this half trying to see the game out Grealish now it's out to Gilbert Now, oh, Gossi's kept it in. Nakamba's there! It's 2 0. Sorry, that was not Nakamba, that was Samata. But Samata scores with his head. Absolutely sensational header. Not quite sure what Larice was doing off his line there. Great ball in and great header from Samata. Samata puts Aston Villa 2 0 up here. There's not much chanting going on from the Tottenham fans. All we can hear is Aston Villa. Villa have been playing very well on the counter-attack, but at the start of the second half, they came out very strong and got that second goal they needed. Aurea now. Nice bit of skill from Aurea. Trezegate puts a challenge in, keeps it in play. And McGinn turns. Great turn from McGinn. Here's Neves. Lost by El Ghazi, though. Neves doing a lot of work here. His son into Harry Kane. It's a great ball into Wings. Pepe Reina called for the first time in this game. Great save. Here's McGinn. This could be a counter attack again, though. It's unlucky. Deli Ali into Harry Kane. Harry Kane could play to Wings. Outs from Minson. Tries his fake shot. Gilbert, great defending. Here comes Grealish, Jack Grealish. What could he do here? He could play El Ghazi. Nakamba's in there again. Should have tried a switch there, which I did look for, but it didn't come off like I wanted it to. Here's Neves, catching up with Son. This is brilliant from Ruben Neves. Great chance from Neves and great working. Here is Son. Son's been quite a danger man, but Gilbert's had him in his back pocket for the second half. Grealish turns into the centre to McGinn. Here's McGinn driving with the ball. McGinn. Samata out to Grealish. Grealish into Gilbert. Gilbert back into Grealish. Grealish gets it again. Poor ball from Neves though. New sign in Neves. Give it away there. It's Mings. Mings gonna have to go to him. Does so. Drags Harry Kane out wide, and that's brilliant defender from Tyro Mings. And Trezeguet. Trezeguet could be in. And then I've got the pace. Cuts inside. Fake shots again. He shoots. It's blocked. Trezeguet couldn't play it to Grealish there, though. Engel's gotta win the header. Does though. Here's McGinn. Nice flick out to target. It's a great ball. 
Grealish cuts inside. Grealish on his right foot. It's a good effort from Jack Grealish. Just whiskers away from the post, though. Harry Winks is coming off for... I'm pretty sure that's Lo Celso, indeed. Al Ghazi putting the pressure on. Ghazi now to Samata. Samata hasn't got much options. Should he hold it. Al Ghazi with a ball in. Not a bad ball in. So we reached the 85th minute here at Tottenham Hotspur Stadium. Harry Kane's made a run. Wrong decision making though from Deli Alley. It could be in a counter attack here. Grealish has made a run through the middle. Had to play it back because he would have been offside. Grealish finds himself in space again. Grealish is going to hit one. Luis with a save. Samata. It's a Neves. The new sign. It could have scored. El Ghazi. Poor shot from El Ghazi. Two added minutes here. Could be a chance for Samata. So Mata couldn't go, do much there. And that is it. Aston Villa 2, Tottenham Hotspur 0. The first game of the season, Aston Villa with very high hopes for this season. That was a very good performance. Second half, they played much better than the first as they dominated in the second half. First half was more 50-50, but it was a very good game. So we're going to have a post-match post interview here. Great performance from Aston Villa against one of the top teams in the Premier League. Good start of the season. The lads did give 100% out there. Nevers put in very good, strong debut. No pressure on him though. It was going to be a challenge and we did get up to that challenge. 85 manager rating now. As I said earlier, I did say we would be signing two players in this episode, and I never actually mentioned who the other signing would be. Well, I think we should improve on the CDM or the right wing, and I decided to go for the right wing. And we're going to see if there's any right wingers in the Premier League that are a good standard and young. Stephen Bergwijn, good option. Hudson Odoi, Young, Mares, Pedro Ayuso, Perez, Bernardo Silva. But who we have gone, we're going to go for a player who I've had in mind for a while. Very good potential with him. And it is going to be Rodrigo from Real Madrid at right winger. Release clause. We're not going to be signing him in this episode, but he's definitely going to be there. We might be able to. We're going to, his release clause is 44 million. We only have 19 million, but, but we could get him for under his release clause. We could see how much, maybe loan him, maybe loan him. If we could loan him, that would be a very good player for this season. We are negotiating to loan as well. It could be a very good signing for Aston Villa. So we want to have a two year deal potentially. Let's see what he thinks. Yep, two year loan deal. That's very good. We need to share 60 40. So 64 rules. We're going to counter with that and we're going to do a 55. Should we see if he takes that? He agrees with that. And Rodrigo is one of ours for two seasons now. Great player with great potential. And we think he should be put straight onto the bench. Not quite sure where he is. Might I think it takes a little while for a lone player to come in the squad. We're going to skip over to our next game. And that will be for the next episode. Lone Moon Rejected. He comes to come soon. Rodrigo's loan has been rejected for some reason. Not quite sure. Maybe he didn't want to join us. Hmm. 
so we're going to be looking in for a new right winger next episode guys I think that'll be the most fairest thing to do maybe a youngster and I have someone in um, have somebody in my mind or a few people in mind that we could have I will shortlist them for the next episode be sure to tune in for the episode tomorrow because there will be one out tomorrow at around 5 p.m. tomorrow this video is our start of one hope you enjoyed the road to glory guys and we'll be playing Bournemouth in our next match see you tomorrow